Hi everyone, this is Charlotte from Colorful Teaching for You. Happy Valentine's Day in advance! <laughs> oh, I'm so happy that you could join me today. Uh, today starts a very special time in our lives. It is the first week of the three week challenge. How exciting! Um, we're going to be showing love to the different people in our lives these next three weeks. So, the first week, this week, we're going to be starting with a family member. Now, I would highly recommend that you choose one family member. Please don't go for two, three, four, because you're setting yourself up for failure. So if you choose one, you can really show them love over this week. I wouldn't do it every moment of your life though, because it might be a little bit much. So maybe do it once, twice, three times, or a little bit every day, right? Don't go overboard, <laughs> that's all I'm saying. Um, so we are going to be talking about the four affinities of the heart. And this is something that I've coined. So you've heard it here first. <laughs> um, the affinities of the heart can be broken down into the first segment, which is notes from the heart. And this is where we talk about, or actually we don't talk about, we write down all the ways that this person, this family member has impacted your life and why you love and care for them. Because let's face it, lots of people don't know um, the impact that they have on other people and how wonderful they are. Um, so this is such a great way to really connect with them. The second uh, part is spoken from the heart. This is where you take what you did in the first part, but instead of writing it down, you would actually say it out loud to them. This takes a little bit more courage, and for some people this is not the way to go, but if it is something you'd like to try, I'd highly recommend doing it. It's super fun. And it's so, so, so meaningful because you're actually in the moment verbalizing it to them. So you're actually having this heart-to-heart -heart conversation. So if you can, try it. If not, go for the first one and do uh, notes from the heart. The third one, and I love this one because if I were to go to a restaurant, I look for this and it is combos, combos from the heart. And this is where you combine number one and number two together. So you would write to them and you would speak to them. So I don't know if you're able to do this, go for it, but it sounds a little bit cheesy to some people. <laughs> Does to me. It's not something I can do because I'm not overly, um, I'm not overly, I, I like to say the word mushy. It's just not for me. But for some people, this is the way to go. And if you can do it, it is so much more meaningful on a whole new level. So really, if you can try it, do it. And the fourth one, to me, this just overpowers every one of them. This is the most meaningful thing that you can do for anyone and this is called um, special time from the heart this is where you spend one-on-one -on -one time with that person you show them that you love them you demonstrate this raw authentic love that you have for them and showing is always so much better than actually telling or writing you know so show them that you love them and if you want and if you're brave enough you can do all four of them, why not? But try and start small. If this is something that scares you a little bit, try and start small and build your way up. So this week, we again are talking about family members and we talked about notes from the heart. We talked about spoken from the heart, combos, so you're combining the first two. And then we talked about special time from the heart where you spend time with them. All four of them make up the four affinities of the heart. So I sincerely hope you pick one family member, show them how much you care about them, and maybe over the next several weeks, you are welcome to, to do this with other family members as well, okay? So I am actually going to be joining you on this journey, and so I'm super excited, and I've written about it in my blog, who I'm going to be um, uh, focusing on this month or this week. So uh, join us over at colorfulteachingforyou.com. Colorful has a U in it. 
And if you haven't already grabbed your freebie about 15 strategies to take care of yourself, and it also comes with a reflective guide, please join us again at colorfulteachingforyou.com. And at the very top on the menu bar, there's the little button called freebies. Please click on it and grab yours. Thank you so much for joining me. Happy Valentine's Day in advance to you and your family members. Take care and remember to create, experience, and teach from the heart. Have a lovely day. Bye.